What? Oh, we're doing the review right now? Oh, all right. Well, hey everyone, this is Dave LeClaire, gaming editor for MakeUseOf.com, and I'm here to tell you all about the Turtle Beach Ear Force Atlas headset, which is a Titanfall branded headset from Turtle Beach, a company that you will probably recognize as one of the premier names in making gaming headsets. Now this is a wired headset, as you can see by this bad boy right here, but don't let that deter you because it actually is a very good headset, but we'll get to more of the specifics later. What you need to know right now is that this headset comes with a $149 price tag, which is about mid-grade in terms of the Turtle Beach. When you get up to the wireless surround sound simulated headsets, the price tends to jump a little bit, but as far as the headsets at this price level go, this one is pretty solid, and we're gonna get to why in just a second. So hang out, keep watching, see you on the other side. So since these are Titanfall branded headphones, I think the first thing we need to talk about is the look of the headphones. Because generally speaking, if you're buying something that's branded specifically for a game, the look is probably going to be one of the first things you're worried about. And as you can see, the look of the headphones is actually fairly subdued. It's not overpowering. It does feature Titanfall branding, at least the corporation in it. Uh, it has some text on it and on the top of the headphones it does say Titanfall so you can let everybody know what game you're representing if they're not too familiar with the actual branding as far as the Atlas Titan goes but they're definitely cool looking and the color palette of just some gray black and a little bit of red a little bit of blue makes them so that even if you're not the kind of person who's really in love with Titanfall and you like it and you just happen to like the headphones they're still completely usable and you won't feel ridiculous wearing them because the color palette is not too in your face so as far as the look goes, I definitely like them. As someone who enjoys playing Titanfall, I like them even more. But even if you don't, they're just cool looking headphones. Even if you don't like the game, you'll still think they look pretty cool, chances are. Because hey, they kind of do. Alright, so the next thing we need to talk about is the comfort of the headphones. As you can see, the ear pads are nice and soft. So you're going to get good comfort out of those. They're not going to hurt your head too much. You'll definitely enjoy wearing them. Now if you wear them for hours on end, they will cause a little soreness on the top of your ears just from the weight of having all this extra amount on your head and pressing down on your ears. But that's going to happen from pretty much any headphones. As far as headphones go, these are fairly light, especially when you consider how big they are. So they're not too bad in that regard, but if you do wear them for, you know, five, six hours on end, which I have done, I did find that my ears got a little bit sore. But it wasn't anything that was too bad and it wasn't anything that was like, oh, I'm never going to wear these again. It was just a very minor thing and I took them off for a few minutes, took a break, put them back on and everything was fine. So they're definitely a comfortable headphones. They have some padding on the top right here on the top of your head so you get some nice squishiness so you're not digging into the top of your head when you're wearing them, which is great. And I think Turtle Beach definitely nailed it as far as the comfort goes. So the last thing that we need to talk about is the sound quality. Now the sound quality on these is good, but it is not fantastic. The voice quality from the microphone is fantastic. It sounds great. I let a friend borrow them so that I could hear it myself, just to make sure that when everyone was telling me, oh, it sounds great, you know, I needed to judge that on my own. And they sound really, really good. So you can definitely speak into them. Your friends will hear you very clearly, and that's great. The audio quality, now because the Xbox One only supports stereo, not simulated surround sound through the earphones you're only getting two channels of sound so it's not quite as good as like some of the wireless ones that are available for Xbox 360 but it does have good punch from the bass hits the highs pretty well and it's definitely solid they're 50 millimeters so there's you know they're decently powerful without blowing your eardrums out but the lack of surround sound is probably going to be a sticking point for some people who are used to like the Turtle Beach the Ear Force X7s or X07s the ones that have surround sound built right into the ears especially when you're playing a shooter and you get that depth of where everybody is as they're coming up from behind you. You don't get that with these, but they're also not as expensive as those, so there's that trade-off. You get these for a more reasonable price, and you get some pretty cool Titanfall branding on it. So it's a trade-off, but just keep that in mind. If you're going to buy these and you're thinking they're surround sound, you're going to be disappointed when you realize that they're not. So there you go. They sound pretty good, but they're not the best. So to wrap up, I'll say this. The Turtle Beach Ear Force Atlas headset is very solid. If you're a fan of Titanfall, you absolutely should get this headset. It's only $150, which is not bad when you compare it to some of the other on the market. The only one that's really cheaper that's decent is the official Xbox One headset, but it doesn't have nearly the level of versatility as this one because this can be used with the 360, the PC, with your mobile phone, your tablet, and even with a PS4 because it just uses a standard headphone input on the PS4 controller. 
So you can really use this headset with everything. Now if you hate Titanfall, and it's a game you're never going to play, or you played and you didn't like it, wearing Titanfall branding all over your head, probably not going to appeal to you. Yes, it is slightly subdued, but it's still there, and if you don't like Titanfall, you're probably not going to want to wear it. But if you like Titanfall, you want a good headset, I definitely recommend picking up the Turtle Beach Ear Force Atlases, because they're pretty damn solid.